Let's have a talk, man. Harden? Yeah, Harden, nigga. Where's my teammates? Which do y'all prefer? Uh, current or, um, next? Look at this. Look at. Look at this. Who found these tweets? Who found these tweets, man? Yo, here with this little. Look, look at this. 2015, man. Let's bring back slavery. Think about it. We're so much more technological advanced now. It would work so much better. You know the type of know how to zoom in. Fuck. You can't see this? What are you saying? Heat versus Warriors, nigga. Warriors gonna thrash them niggas. But um same sex marriage is legal, but slavery ain't? What the fuck? This is a whole different level, bro. You know how many friends he has to have to do this? And imagine if if the nigga didn't look up slavery, like he probably had a bunch of other shit on his shit. Imagine if we didn't abolish slavery. Shouldn't have ended slavery. Like what is going on? Now he's like the top 2K YouTuber. Benefiting off of fucking a sport that's like 70% black people, bro. Bruh, they not suffering from slavery. 9-11 is near and dear to us, brother. What? Come on, nigga. Come on, nigga. And you know what's crazy, bro? Dignify, bro. Y'all don't know who Dignify is? He was 12 back then? Bro, he's a grown man. What you mean? How old is Dignify? He's probably like 25 or 24. Bro, that racist shit don't leave you, bro. Bro, all of people are like that? What you talking about, nigga? He's 25, see? 25 minus five, okay, 20. Like, come on, bro, the nigga coherent, nigga. What, what you talking about? He probably was saying that after, too, and then, like, chilled out. You think he just changed? The the one from 2017? Like, so you, you, you think he just stopped? No hella entertains. Bro, when it comes to racism, bro, that's a whole different level, my nigga. It's not about, like, you know, all the, you know, telling niggas to kill themselves and all that. Like, that, that shit is, that's nowhere compared to racism, nigga. Niggas was enslaved, bro. That shit is different. But yeah, a lot of white content creators are like that. And it's just nobody cares, bro. Like, nothing's going to happen. I bet you, I bet you a bunch of niggas are going to be like defending him and shit like he's gonna have a bunch of black people that are like oh dignify is my white savior and they're gonna be like defending this nigga niggas is sellouts bro shit is bad just watch i don't, I don't know who the fuck let's let, let's check out his twitter man hold on let's see what he said who found these tweets Let's see. I can only ask for your forgiveness. I am insanely sorry. I want to start off by expressing how apologetic I am for the tweets I had sent out in 2015, 16 at the age of 17 and 18 years old. 17 to 18, bro. You think that shit went away? Or you think he just started doing YouTube and shit? 17 to 18, nigga? Come on, bro. Or he just started being a teacher, nigga. The nigga said he worked like five years in an elementary school. Imagine, bro. The, these are today's teachers. Back then's teachers. Like, 
You think you'll get a good education from someone like that? Think your kid's gonna get raised right, nigga? That shit bad, bro. Back then, I was in the COD community. See, look, let, let me let me tell y'all another thing, how you uh figure out these racists, my nigga. When they like to talk about how much they love COD and shit, and like that, that type of shit, man. I don't know, bro. I, I just feel like a lot of them niggas, they were one of those spamming the hard ERs. Bro, to be honest, nigga, I could literally get on COD right now. For y'all niggas that watch me, y'all have seen it. Any lobby I go into, bro. Any lobby I go into. OD racial slurs. OD, nigga. It's never ending, bro. Like, I really think, like, all niggas are racist, bro. Except, like, a little low percent, bro. Like, I'm so serious, bro. I feel the vibes, my nigga. Because... I get like I get to have interactions with niggas at like a different level. Like some of these niggas, they don't like me for like no reason, bro. You know? And I can feel it and we'll like get into it and shit. Like niggas with clout that they don't beef with nobody else. But for some reason they have issues with me of all people. Is it, is it cuz I like embody like a nigga or something? Like how I talk? Like I don't, I don't know, bro, but this is crazy, bro. Ever since this has brought up, been brought up, I had zero idea I had even tweeted this. I felt horrible. I'm sorry for those whom I've offended. I'm a changed man who doesn't joke around like that anymore. I cannot do anything but ask for your forgiveness. I hope those that have gotten to know me these past few years making content, that's not who I am, nor has it ever been. I know that's not something to joke around with and is extremely inconsiderate and intolerable, and I hope you can find it in your hearts to forgive me. Again, I'm insanely sorry. Dignify. Shit crazy, bro. How many black people y'all think are gonna, uh, you know, defend this nigga? <laughs> How many black people y'all think are gonna defend this nigga? Bro, to be honest, bro, y'all viewers, if y'all see anyone do that shit, you need to fucking attack them, bro. You need to flame them. These niggas aren't gonna do shit for you. Y'all need to stop being scared of a fucking YouTuber and streamer, bro. Fuck these niggas, bro. The fuck? Being scared to get banned and shit, bro. Let these niggas know some shit, bro. Niggas out here defending racists. Like, what, what is going on, bro? He not sorry, he just sorry he got caught. Oh God, nigga. And it's it's like for instance, like I've had problems with Dignify, right? And I, I felt the vibe, nigga. I feel the vibe with certain people, bro. There's other 2K creators that I have the vibe with, bro. I ain't gonna name all of them, nigga. But if you know, nigga, I've spoke about it before, bro. You know? I can just feel it, bro. I can tell how they act towards me, man. You know? I remember back with that Nate XC shit, right? This dude was saying hard ER over fucking like, like on video over like 150 times, bro. Over like 150 times. Y'all wanna know who made a video defending Nate Exe, bro? Made a video defending him. Saying his whole career shouldn't end and all this shit. In 2K18, y'all wanna know who it was? What's good, Rich? You reported that nigga on YouTube and sent them a timestamp? Annoying? No, no, no. I'm talking about a white person, bro. We're not talking about... You know, annoying fucking, you know, like that, that, that was his savior, bro. He, he viewed that nigga as his ticket. That, that's why he was defending him. <laughs> the fuck? Like, niggas is lame. Bro, what is you saying cash nasty for, bro? Like, are you good, bro? Uh, I, I'm gonna just tell you, bro. That nigga Joe knows. In 2K18, made a video right this nigga made a video 
insane. Defending Nate XE. Nigga, Nate didn't even apologize, bro. He still didn't apologize at that point once. This nigga made a video saying Nate X shouldn't get his career, all this stuff, all just because he said a word, all this shit, right? And I'm like, bro, how am I the only one that has a problem with this shit? But I'm, I'm, bro, I'm, I'm literally serious. I am like the only real black nigga in the 2K community. All these other niggas are not really black, bro. They're internet niggas. They've not lived a real life. They don't have black fucking like parents and like niggas that instill values in them or like uncles or none of they're not real black people, bro. They're whitewashed. They're they're the type of niggas that will just like defend. They're the type of niggas that'll just fucking defend like white people being racist and, and 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 all this other shit bro i'm always like the only nigga talking about these fucking racist ass niggas bro this nigga made a whole video saying he shouldn't have his career taken away and all this other shit bro and the nigga didn't apologize once he didn't apologize once I commented on that nigga's shit. I'm like, bro, I don't even remember what I said. But, you know, I was calling him out. I think he banned me from his fucking channel or some shit. This is before the nigga, like, blew up and all that shit. But it's like, bro, I be knowing niggas, bro. Like, like, have y'all ever seen that nigga Joe Knows be toxic to anyone? That nigga Joe Knows would always comment on my tweets like talking shit and being weird. Y'all have never seen him do that before to anybody, right? But he only did it to me. Why only me? The ultimate nigga on this shit. That, you know, this... I don't, I don't ever talk to the nigga. Why are you commenting on my tweets? You know? It's because I bothered that nigga, bro. Like how I act, bro. I'm telling you, man, these niggas really be racist telling you bro there's a there's a lot of these niggas y'all have no idea let, let let me give you another tip on how to figure someone out right say you watch someone on youtube right and they're that that super nice super positive guy you know they just seem like nothing's wrong with them just like dignifies video just like dig just like dignifies videos if you go look at his videos they're very positive. They're never toxic. Super genuine and nice. That uppity, giddy, you know, just. And then you see them stream and they're straight toxic. They're just like two different people. Bro, that nigga on YouTube is not a real person. That's a fantasy. And that's what sells, nigga. When niggas do that fake force positivity shit, those be the worst type of niggas, bro. Do your research every single time, nigga. If you can't tell, like, anything wrong with a nigga, like, you don't ever see any type of genuine emotion, just like this fake ass positive vibe shit. What, them niggas, don't trust them niggas, bro. I'm trying to tell you, bro. Them niggas are selling a fantasy, bro. A nigga like me that keeps a 100, bro, you you see, like, I, I be talking shit. Like, nigga, this is me, bro. Like, but a lot of these niggas, they're not who they really are. A lot of people talk about toxic shit always sells and shit, bro. Nigga, posit fake force positivity sells even more, bro. I'm telling you, man. That's why niggas do it seriously in in so many communities like they they have like this image how they act they like they they try to make money off their kids trying to like sell a family vibe and and shit like that and you know they're just selling an image nigga that shit not really them yeah youtube niggas be fake bro they're, they're not real people bro all those fucking family channels 
niggas niggas on Twitch trying to use their family or whatever to 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 get like sympathy and money and shit and y'all niggas is all being sold fan fantasies, man. Most of these creators, bro, they're just master manipulators, nigga. Y'all niggas have no idea, bro. Yeah, entertains. What's good, uh, chaos? Bro, nobody doesn't care. If you don't, there ain't gonna be no bounce back. Ain't gonna be no, uh, ain't gonna be no dip, nigga. What's good, Chief? You think niggas care? You're crazy, bro. Oh, you got it, Liam. What the fuck? Savior! Nigga, didn't you already sub, bro? You subbed offline. I'm lost. You subbed yesterday before I even started my shit. That racist uh, really instilled in them. That's bad, bro. I don't get it. Like, how can you instill hate in a child? Niggas is weird, man. Dun, 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 dun. He made apology, so nothing happened to him, I fear. Nothing's gonna happen, bro. Niggas don't care, bro. Cereal. Yes, hoodie. Haven't you asked me that before? Why you keep asking me about Steezo, bro? We talk every day for about two hours, my nigga. Every day. Look at this. He said, fuck you, build that wall. Don't know who Martin Luther, like, bro, what? Damn. Look at this shit. How you a middle school teacher and don't know how to delete all your Twitter tweets? Like, that's how dumb niggas is, bro. Bro, this is crazy. Like, what's wrong with this nigga? I bet you them niggas hate Kaepernick, too. And they don't even watch football. That's crazy. Niggas is weird, bro. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.